for 29 months. I've kind of just been sitting here, I'm not gonna lie. There's not much going on. I've had the most boring day. <laughs> Editing you out of Hoenn? What the hell? Spoilers? That's fine, honestly. No, I'm just kidding. I swear I'll be good. Thanks for 29 months. That's a long fucking time. That is long as heck. Jack, you'd be so proud of me. I've been freaking editing, dude. I just cut I just cut a video, y'all. I cut one! Oh look at the wave. <laughs> sick! It was sick! And also, check this out. Boom! New camera. What? What? We're growing! Hi, Glunky. Thanks for 10 months. Thank you. Look at it! Oh my god, it's so detailed. <laughs> I'm gonna throw up. Stop, I'm nervous. Don't look at me. <laughs> oh, it's sick! It's so sick. Um, I would show you the comparison between my old camera and my new one, but, uh, I can't because there's so much trash and messy and clutter just outside of frame here. I'm like, wait, this is actually sick that I don't need to <laughs> clean up as much because you guys don't need to see it. <laughs> uh, hello. Hello, hello. Hi, Sir Let's Dave. go. Hi, everyone. Hope you all are doing well. We're doing great. We're doing so good. Thank you for 26 months. I appreciate you. And I hope you are doing well. I like that Raging Wolf Helm thingy. I like that. Ooh. Watching Elden Ring. I probably don't have that. But hello! Yes, we got a new camera. I'm very excited. Well, like, I've had this camera for a little bit, but the lens on it was bad. So, it was just like really zoomed in. So, for Prime Day, I decided to look at lenses and found this one for a really good deal and decided to go for it. Um, but thanks. Yeah, super, super W moment. Pretty hype. I got it. I, I've had a weekend, y'all. I've had a weekend that I basically set up for myself. On Saturday, I went to my best friend in the whole wide world's baby shower, and that was crazy because she's having a baby. And there was a lot of people there that were both family and friends, and I've never really seen like that many people in the same room. It was overwhelming. It was very weird. Um, and then I came home and then I slept. And then yesterday was Tynamo Community Day. I woke up at like 10.30. I was thinking maybe I'll get some cleaning done and then I'll take a walk. And then the thought occurred to me, can I walk to Fenway Park from my apartment? I'm not close to Fenway Park. I'm, you know, in the Boston area, but I'm not super close, you know? And Map said it was about a three and a half hour walk. And I said, I could do that in three. I'm a fast walker. And so then I did. I left my house at like noon-ish, 12.30. Walked to Fenway Park. On the way there, Tynamo Community Day started. On the way there, Joe Biden drops out of the election, you know? A lot of stuff went on in this little walk. We made it to Fenway. My legs were only a little bit in pain. And I thought, I can walk back home. I can do it. I can walk the, you know, four and a half miles back home. I can do it. I don't know. Maybe it was closer to like three, but I forget. But <sighs> that walk home was so fucking rough. Oh my God. I had to stop and sit a couple different times. I had to stop at a Whole Foods nearby to grab some food and sit down for a minute at their little eating area because it was, my knees were... <laughs> My knees have like blown out. I am fucked. I have been limping around my whole apartment all day today. <laughs> I woke up this morning and I and I got out of bed and I stood up and I was like, oh no. 
Why did I do that? <laughs> Why did I do that yesterday? Well, my plan was, my plan was I would walk there and then I could take like, you know, the train home or the bus home, you know, take some transportation home, figure it out. But then when I got there and I was like, I can do the walk home. I was committed at that point. And I walked by, I walked by all the train stations. I walked by all the buses and I was like, nope, not gonna do it. I can make it. But the last like hour of walking, there's like no train, no bus. It's like paths. It's not like streets, you know, it's not like a busy area. And oh my God, it was the worst mistake I could have ever made. I was in so much pain. I was about to fucking die in the woods. <laughs> it was so bad. I felt extremely accomplished when I was done with it though. Tynamo day was, it was worth it. I got 24 shinies, but all of, all of the shinies I got fucking sucked. I'm not kidding. Every single shiny I checked, it was like zero stars, zero stars, zero stars. And not even Nundos. Not even like a fun Nundo, you know? It was all just like, eh, a little bit here and there throughout. Fucking awful, awful. Plus I hate Tynamo. I'm not kidding, the number of times I opened up a Tynamo immediately went to close out only for the sparkles to appear as I was leaving. I was like, oh, I guess that was the shiny. Can't even fucking notice. It's just like, it's the worst shiny ever made. It's the worst. And not to mention that, so some people are like, it's super noticeable, what do you mean? The little orange line. The little orange line on the side is completely covered up by Pokemon Ghost text saying Tyno you encountered Tynamo or Tynamo appeared or whatever. So the text is in the way. You can't even see what color the line is behind the text. And so I'm leaving every single battle, but it turns out it was a shiny every time. Stupid ass fish. And they're this big on the screen and there's 50 of them around you. So you don't know which ones you've actually encountered and <laughs> I'm joking. And which one you like, you know, so I think I ended up catching just out, just to get them off of my screen. I had to have ca caught hundreds of Tynamo yesterday. Like I walked away, I think I, ha I, think I collected like 1800 Tynamo candy yesterday. Like so many, <laughs> the stupidest fish ever made. Also, hi Courtney. I love you so much. Stop barking for me. Come over, I'm barking for you. I fucking love you and miss you. Take me to Hawaii with you. I got five for them in the first two minutes, no joke. I didn't get a shiny for the first like 45 minutes of the event. I tweeted or I posted on my Instagram story right before the event started. Um, I hope I get zero shinies because I hate that sperm looking motherfucker. Because I do, I don't like Tynamo. And sure enough, it was like the first like <laughs> 30 to 40 minutes, every single one I checked was not shiny. I was like, am I actually not gonna get a shiny Tynamo for Tynamo Day because I predicted it? That's so fucked up. That's so fucked up. But we ended up getting a ton in the last two and a half hours. And uh, yeah, I don't know. Every it was worth it because I got some really good exercise in, but it was not worth it because I don't like Tynamo. And now I have 24 shinies of them in my boxes. Yay! Courtney, thank you for the gifted sub to Talon. Thank you, thank you. Talon, enjoy your gifted subby. Thank you, cutie. I love you. Yeah, their hitboxes overlapped. Oh, not to mention the the curved catches, like the curveball throws. That motherfucker is so close to the screen that doing a curveball throw, you have to be like super like gentle about it. Like you can't just like curve and throw. You have to be like curve and Boop, like very like very little to make sure it's getting into the circle that you needed to get to god it's a nightmare 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 not to mention okay not to complain i know all i'm doing is complaining right now but also your phone screen is really hard to see when it's really bright outside right and so they picked what is arguably like the brightest time ever to host Tynamo Community Day, a Pokemon that is really, really small and really, really hard to spot the shiny. I was like, make it make sense. <laughs> Put me on the board. I would have, I would have predicted that this would be an issue miles away. Pokemon sleep. Yeah, I've been Pokemon sleeping lately. 
I've been Pokemon Sleep in the last, I don't know, month or two. After I finally got a shiny in Pokemon Sleep, I was like, okay, I get it. It took me 60 sleep sessions to get a shiny. And I've gotten three, maybe, three or four. And that was, my last one was probably like a month ago. And I'm getting pretty fucking sick of that game again. <laughs> not gonna lie. I woke up to 10 Pokemon this morning and not a single one. Not a single one was shiny. Like what gives? It's the anniversary event. You can't just like be nice to me. Awful. Did I tell you on Friday I top cut an MSS? Shit! Wait, you got some CP on Friday? Oh my god! Holy shit, congrats. That's awesome. Oh my god. You must be like hyped the fuck up. Yeah, I gotta play Pokemon. Uh, guys, I think I'm just gonna do Pokemon Go. I'm kind of sick of VGC. The game itself is fun, but that community is... Uh, it's a lot. I have found my own little safe space in the VGC community, and I don't want to look for any more. A lot of people just disappoint me. <laughs> I'm sick of VGC. So, I think... I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep it cool. My local VGC scene, scene is really, really nice. So, I'll probably stick local. I don't know how many events I'm gonna attend next year. If you wanna be done, you should be done. It's like, I don't wanna be done, but the people there are making me wanna be done. But, I'll probably stick to the local scene. I really, I can't go to Baltimore uh, because I have a wedding to go to. And then outside of that, it's like, I don't even know what event I would go to. I'm assuming there's gonna be another Orlando this year. Like I would do Orlando just cause my mom lives in Florida and that's when it, that's, that's one that's like an easy excuse for me to see my family after the event is over. That's what I did this year. Um, I would love to not go to NAIC next year because I fucking hated it this year. I did not have a very good time. I mean like, I think I had, I, I had a good time when I was with the right people, but it was hard to be with the right people all weekend, and I just did not have a great time. I do not like New Orleans. <laughs> I just don't, I just don't like that place. I, I, it's just not my vibe. I don't know. Not my vibe, too swampy. It's difficult to breathe in, and um, I don't know. It's just not, yeah, Bourbon Street was not not the vibe. Not my favorite place. Yeah, Ragov Ragov is a treasure and deserves to be protected at all costs. Genuinely. Fucking love Ragov. I'm an officially an honorary Atlanta Falcons fan by saying you don't like New Orleans? Okay, we did it. God, you're gonna be pissed when I find out I'm a Pats fan. Wait until you find out. Ugh, but I don't really watch football. I'm not a sports girly. I'm a sports girly in the sense where if I'm in the environment, I like know what's going on. Like I know how to watch football. I know what I know how to keep up with the rules. Same with hockey. But it's like, do I really know or care about any players or teams? No, not really. I think because I live in Boston, I'm like legally obligated to be a Pats fan. Cause if I root for a team that isn't the Patriots and I live in this area, I will be smited on the spot by any given neighbor or person on the street. Hi, Arlie, the camera slay. Thank you, I'm so happy. I'm actually pumped. I did not like it when I first put it in, but now I've adapted to it a lot. Looks incredible, thank you. I I got a super good deal on it too. This lens that I bought, is it was like 150 bucks. Like, it was really, really cheap for what it was. Um, so, I'm, I'm hype about it. What's up, Locke? <laughs> yeah, we're good. How are you? I'm a sports girly, isn't I like the food when people have sports get-togethers? Amen. I'm there for the chicken wings. I'm not a huge buffalo guy, but if I'm in the environment, I'll force a wing down, you know? Will I like it? Probably not, it's a little spicy. <laughs> but, but I'll pretend. I'm fine. <laughs> Your first message was so hype. What's good, motherfuckers? Y'all good? And then you said, I'm fine. 
Okay. <laughs> All right. Well, we're here for you, man. Chat, go follow Arlie. That's my bestie. I love her. Uh, how are we doing today? Um, I was going to... Oh! We're gonna find a quick Alolan Raichu before we play Pokemon Coliseum, if that's cool. Because Harumi reminded me yesterday that that event is ending soon. And I can't... Forget to get a shiny Alolan Raichu. I think it'll probably take me like five minutes. Oh my god. I don't know what I I don't know what I have for like Herba. We might just have to wing it. We might just have to raw dog the outbreak if that's cool. Um, but yeah, we're gonna do that and then we're gonna play some Pokemon Coliseum. I think that's the vibe for today. I'm live so early, I'd love to pull off a long stream. I would love to go a solid five hour chunk tonight. That's my goal. Um, what am I doing? What the frick am I doing? Whoa, look at that chat. Oh my God, you guys are like running over the screen. Y'all good? Goodness gracious. No Herba? Yeah, we're gonna go no- we're gonna no Herba it. I feel like even with Char, I'd be seeing shinies everywhere. I feel like 99% of the time when I use- When I use Herba uh, on an outbreak, it's- it, like, has a counter effect, and I just don't get any shinies. You know? We a bit talkative? I know, I do feel talkative today. I feel like a... a little bit of a blabber today. No herba, no method equal- raw- yeah, we're raw-dogging it. We're straight- we're straight raw-dogging raw it. Why is this- why is this not working? Oh my god, wait, I think it, it actually was working. I am stupid! Hey! As it turns out, I'm stupid. I don't even know if I've connected to the internet on Scarlet Violet to trigger this outbreak occurrence from even starting. I can't even lie to you. I have no more herb after hunting sh six shiny Kranidos. Why would you do that? Why do you need more than two? Sometimes you got a raw dog. Chat, can I, can I admit something to you? I walked past Fenway Park yesterday and I did not get a hot dog. I walked past easily four hot dog stands did not stop to eat one i genuinely think that's what made me blow my kneecap out <laughs> i had hot dog control i don't know why i'm not gonna lie it was because it was like 12 no it was like actually it was like two o'clock 2 30 like it was kind of normal time but there was not a single person at any of the hot dog stands because there was not a baseball game today, as in yesterday. There was not a baseball game yesterday. The fucking Foo Fighters were playing at Fenway Park yesterday. <laughs> I got, I almost got to the park and there's like mass floods of people walking towards the park. I'm like, what's going on? Hello? And then I see guys saying like, t-shirts, t-shirts. And uh, they got, they got the Foo Fighters, you know, knockoff t-shirts. I'm like, oh, Foo Fighters are playing. That's right. Um, I will say two, and I don't know if this happened. Okay, sorry, I'm talking a lot, but outside of Fenway Park, maybe this happens at other park arenas. This might be a secret life hack that I want to share with you all. They had merch tents, like full official merch tents for the bands that were playing at Fenway Park outside of Fenway Park. Like just anyone walking around the, the area, which is like just open streets. They had like merch tents, like I could just stop and get official Foo Fighters merch and make it seem like I spent hundreds of dollars on a ticket, but I actually didn't. 
kind of genius. Like, I'm gonna think about next time I see a cool artist that I like playing at Fenway, I'm not buying tickets because that's way too expensive, but I'll go to Fenway and get a t-shirt for $85, you know? A lot of stadiums do that? Okay, well, shit. That's a... That's a life hack. You're welcome. How do I get to the map? I don't know how to play this game. All right, there are no Pikachu outbreaks. I do need to connect to the internet. Look at those glooms back there. They're so cute. Hello, thousands. Welcome. What's going on? Also, hi, Kraiko. It's not, it's like I don't even know you anymore. You changed. I know, I used to be the glizzy gobbler. I've gobbled my last glizzy. Do we go for a Lolan Raichu in the water? That would be cool, right? A surfing boy? Where he belongs? Exclusively spawns on the coastal biome? Pfft, it's like I knew. I'm kind of sad I didn't get a Destiny Mark Galarian Slowpoke, but that's okay. There's always next year. All right, watch this. First try. Okay, the shade does actually kind of throw you off. That's kind of scary. It's like a beautiful, beautiful dark chocolate color. Is Raichu still popping up? Yeah, this event ends on Thursday. That's why I'm doing it now, just because I know I'm going to forget. If I don't do it right this second. God, doing this on water was a mistake. I wanted to do it for the aesthetic, but... It's just so laggy. It's just the most laggy... The most laggy game you've ever played. I wonder if I can remove oop, remove background music. And that way we can still hear the sparkles when I inevitably find it in two seconds. It's a Christmas miracle. Have I shared with the chat how much I'm obsessed with Smiling Friends lately? That show has taken over my entire vernacular. I'm not even kidding. Every single moment of my life reminds me of a Smiling Friends episode. Oh my god, Austin! I swear to god, did not see your name in the chat when I started talking about my new obsession for Smiling Friends. It's Austin's fault that I even got in it in the first place. He's like, it's so funny, you gotta try it. And I'm like, yeah, is it though? Is it? You know, am I really gonna trust this random guy to provide me with show recommendations? And then I gave it a shot. Oh my God, dude, it's the funniest show ever made. It's just the best, it's the fucking best show ever made, unfortunately. Does that mean I should doodle smiling friends for you? Yeah, I mean like, no pressure, but if it helps at all, uh, I am Alan, okay? In the grand scheme of things, I am Alan and Kathy is my glep. And she 100% agrees with me. I think she streams tonight. Oh wait! Nope. <laughs> stupid. I'm stupid, sorry. Have a good day. Wait for nothing, I meant. <laughs> I did, I just pogged. I just pogged on stream. <laughs> Awkward. But yeah, Kathy and I are Alan and Glep. She's so Glep coded, it, it's, it's painful. It's so spot on. There's this damn rat.
but I feel ashamed to even attempt to like do any silly little quotes because they make me feel like I'm just the most cringe person on earth. Like it's the, it's the same similar energy as like being a Rick and Morty fan. I hate to say it. It's like, I know Smiling Friends is so much better than Rick and Morty, but like proudly announcing to the world that I'm a Smiling Friends fan, it's like, <laughs> like next I'm gonna be like asking for like, sh like Szechuan sauce or whatever, like it's cringe. It's cringe and I don't care. I have to own it, but it'll take time. Just know that I'm literally always watching that show 24 seven. <laughs> I'm literally never not watching Smiling Friends. I watch it in like two months when people have already moved on to something else. I recommend watching it right now. I'm not gonna lie, watching the entirety of season one and two of Smiling Friends, it's like two hours of content. <laughs> like that's it. It's like, it's like not a lot of stuff. Each episode is like 11 minutes long. And there's only two seasons and each season has like eight episodes. So. Where is this thing? It's darker than these, right? I'm just being silly. <laughs> I'm just being silly, Goofy. Hello, Diddy Bim. I love saying hello. Um, my Discord entry song when I enter a Discord call, like you know how you can trigger a soundboard sound to go off when you enter a Discord call. <laughs> My entrance sound is uh, Smormu's, uh, like, Snake Charmer song. Danny64, thank you for the raid. Hello. Welcome on in, raiders. Hello, hello. Danny, welcome. Hope you had a great stream, my friend. I really appreciate the raid. This is my first time playing Pokemon, so please be nice to me. We're shiny hunting for Alolan Raichu. And then we're playing Pokemon Coliseum. And that's an update on my life. The shaded Alolan Raichus look so dark. They throw me off. Yeah, the, the Samormu. Da -da 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 I think about it. All the time. That song's always playing in my head 24 seven. And that's the shiny Alolan Raichu. Thank you, Smormu. Thank you, Smormu. He said, I love that song. It's stuck in my head all the time too. And it's a girl. Yippee. We did it. Look at her. Oh my God. How can you not think that this is the cutest fucking creature ever created? I'm so sorry. Look at like, I'm sorry. Are you serious? Pokemon popped the fuck off when they made her. <laughs> yeah, that's right, queen. Speak your truth. I'm putting you in a level ball for some reason. When people say that Alolan Raichu is their favorite Pokemon, that is the most valid thing ever. It's so valid. It's unbelievably valid. She should be up, she should be higher up there on my Pokemon list. What, was that a sentence? She should be higher up there on my favorite Pokemon list. Wait, what? Did we just like not get a summary of this Pokemon? What just happened? That was weird. Oh, cause I guess she got added to my party right away. All right, nature guesses. Do we catch another one just for the lulls or um, do we just move on? Months. And you're rocking a new camera? This yes. is great. Thank you as always for being amazing. Less than three. Brave. Thank you for 32 months. Thank you for your lovely, beautiful, amazing, kind message. I appreciate you very much. And I hope you're doing well. Thank you for 32. Hi, Max. Serious nature, lonely, I don't know. Guys, I'm so bad at prompting my chat to say anything. <laughs> Nature guesses, everyone's like, nah, I don't really want to. Eh, I'm good. Oh! Oh, we said timid nature right before I clicked over. Boom. Nailed it. You knew. You knew. 
And um, I don't think she has any marks. I think it would show up looking different, right? Um, new cam goes crazy. Thank you. Also, Danny, thank you. Thank you for the raid. I appreciate you, dude. Thank you, thank you. You want me to catch 50 shiny Raichu? All right, well. It'll be a long stream, but we, we have to do it now. It's a formal request by the streamer. I guess because Harumi already knew. Harumi always knows. Harumi the Oracle. It's not a mark event, unfortunately. Um, no, I know that. But it is, I don't know if you knew this, but it actually is possible for Pokemon to get marks. No matter the circumstance. It's a fun fact, right? Pretty interesting fact. Yeah, so, uh, the mansplaining was super appreciated though. Like, honestly, I needed it. Yeah, that upbeat Clefairy event was such a fucking joke because I caught <laughs> like eight shiny Clefairy. Not one of them had the upbeat mark. Like what? I, I was getting like uncommon marks and stuff. All kinds of marks, no upbeat mark. I'm like, what is the point of the event? My game did not get the code, apparently. Bitter that you can't evolve a Pikachu into a Lolachu. I know, right? Like the Alolan Executor, like why should it be any different? It's because they know that Alolan Raichu is superior to all other Pokemon, period. They know that Alolachu is just far too powerful. Every single team across every single game would just be six Alolan Raichus if it was possible that way. You might want to catch a regular Alola Chew too because you can't get it without transferring. You know what? That's a great idea. I want a marked one. Ooh, big and mark. And female. Kinda goaded. Kinda sick if you ask me. A big marked baby. Oh, she's so me. She's so me, it hurts. I'm going to put you in a luxury ball. It's what you deserve, queen. It's what you deserve. There's some like strange, very, very mild, but prominent scent coming from this cup. It's like, I can't really place what it is, but this cup does slightly smell strange. Hi, Sanjay. How are you, cutie? <gasps> What's the mark? Sleepy time. The sleepy time mark. Oh, she's goaded for that. Absolutely based. Based behavior to be a sleepy angel. And hello, Alex. How are you? Are you saved yet? <laughs> yes. <laughs> right now. Of course. <laughs> like, duh. Okay, I'll get one more shiny Alolan Raichu just because this is kind of fun and I'm having a little bit of a good time. Just a little bit of one though. Don't you dare tell anybody I was having a good time in Scarlet Violet. Oh wait, is that it? No, I'm just silly. Sorry, I'm silly. Sorry, I have a timer that goes off my phone every 30 seconds. I go, is that it? Just to keep you guys on your toes. <laughs> no way, is that? Sorry. Scootish, I'm pooping? Wow, I'm honored to be your bathroom stream, dude. That's crazy. Thank you so much. I hope it's um, going well. 
Question mark? <laughs> You're cool, I thought you should know. Damn. I do hear that pooping makes you a super honest and truthful person, so whatever you're saying right now is 100% accurate and correct. So, thank you. Thank you, Scootish. Check, go follow Scootish. That's my best friend. Wait, are you still live? Scootish has been subathoning for like a month. <laughs> what the hell? You've been live for so long. And you know, the best part about the fact that, that Scootish has been live for like a month is every, I'm not kidding. Every single time I tune into Scootish's stream, he is not, he is not on cam. <laughs> He's sleeping or doing something or <laughs> like not on stream. And he's still got like a hundred viewers in the chat, like just hanging out. I'm like, that's so based. <laughs> I love it. You're doing amazing, sweetie. I love it so much. Hi, Mago. What's up, dude? Right? This camera's not bad, right? It's not bad. Magoberry was talking me down yesterday. I was like freaking out. That's not true. I sleep. I've, I've only been gone one day. Well, that just shows that I've only tuned into your stream like twice. <laughs> Uh, oh no. Guys, am I gonna get in trouble? Yes. Casey, I'm on the John right now. <laughs> okay, well, um... <clears throat> I just wanted to tell you, if I hear you say one more time, this camera's not bad, right? When you were literally streaming with, like, the equivalent of, like, my thumb being a camera, meaning it was ass before, is it insane. <laughs> I just thought it was too zoomed in. That was the problem. Shit is of higher quality than the last camera. This lens cuts. It's a good lens. All right, it is a good lens. I was just scared it was too zoomed in. You know what I mean? Like, I was like, all I can see is my forehead. You're scared because of different. You're, you're scared because of pain. Cutting the weak, the bulk mind to you. You're like cutting in and out, but I'm totally getting the message. You're so right. I was letting I was I was letting woke talk me out of it. Do not let woke talk you out of it. You're so right. You're so right. Thank you. I'm right wing now. Thanks, dude. No, I'm coconut pills, man. That, that, you, I think you picked up the wrong message of that, bro. Sorry, I can't. I can't hear you. I'm too unburdened by what has been. This is your cringe, man. <laughs> Ah, uh, scootish, ladies and gentlemen. Anyways, go follow my friend. I'm super. I'm. What? I don't know what I was gonna say. I let I let woke almost talk me out of this shit though, for real. I was like I was like, what if the the woke media sees this and says, "Ew, new camera. She looks like shit," you know? This is not Coliseum. Kathy? Can someone ban her? <laughs> I'm just kidding. Uh, we'll get there. I just wanted a shiny Alolan Raichu. And then I found one. But now I want another one. <gasps> oh! Kathy! You're kidding. A marked little female? Kathy, I swear to fucking God. I swear to God, you just did that. What? Oh, you fucking did that. She's so little. Ah! Oh my God. Wait, wait, is that another in the back? No, that's one in the shade. No. It's not, but the shade is so annoying. Yeah, we have to size check her. Kathy, what ball do you want me to put it in? Take your pick, queen. Size check her, what? And then what? No, the shade is, the shade is so fucked up here. It's bad. Love ball, hi. I was hovering over it on purpose. It's gotta be. Oh my god, I'm so- And Crit Cat, she wants to be me so bad! I mean, with me. I don't know why I said be me. I meant be with me. <laughs> if this is- If this is the teensy- 
It's so over. It is so fucking over for me. Um, where am I going? Oh yeah, here. <laughs> Quitting stream. I am so fucking sorry in advance if this is actually it. I've never, but to be fair, I've never gotten like a sized shiny before ever. So this is a little exciting if that's the case. I don't know if that was that small though, you know? If you get the teeny, I'm, if you get the teensy, I'm calling Kryko. <laughs> Kryko getting a phone call, like, wait, what? Okay, are we ready? I didn't even check the mark on this thing, too. She's quirky natured. That's so spot on. Ready? Ah! She lives another day! She gets to live! Oh my god! But this mark, <gasps> another sleepy time mark! Now I have two! I have two sleepies! Look it! Yahoo! She's literally you. What the frick? <gasps> oh my god, look. Oh, she's so cool. She's so freaking cool! Dude. That's awesome. I'm not gonna lie. Wait, has there been any fan art of Alolan Raichu and Goldango? Like, sir- Oh, you're shitting me. Excuse me? <laughs> oh, no way. <laughs> what? That's... Oh, yeah. Okay. That's just about the cutest damn thing I've ever fucking seen in my life. Wow. Don't! Sorry. She's fine. Wow. That is a rat. That's the rat of all time, actually. She is Evie, right? They were not kidding. Look in general Pokemon at Discord. I'm so there. I'm so there in three, two, one. Oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell yeah. What? Check this out. What? That's sick. I love that. Chat, go follow the VODs channel. Guys, I got monetization on wow. my VODs channel now. Yeah, I've made a whopping 15 cents in the last three days. So yeah, it's kind of over for you guys, okay? It's kind of over. <laughs> Look, I don't want to brag, okay? I don't want to brag. Take me out to dinner. Oh, the second I reach the $100 threshold we're going out to dinner youtube money is is dinner money <laughs> it's like one m and m yeah that's huge money is calling hello rich people yes i'll join or he says less I yes i'll hold damn it that was a community moment Sixty dollars. Anyways, I will not be participating in this event any longer. I will not open Pokemon Scarlet in at least another month. Okay. Okay. Why am I at what? I'm like, where's Pokemon Coliseum? Hello. Da da da. Duh. 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 Oh, dolphin? I mean, my GameCube. My GameCube does this thing where, like, the music plays 
in both my headphones and my speakers, and I cannot figure out how to fix it. <laughs> Are you streaming from a GameCube? Yes. Yes, I am. She launches the game in three months and sees the ride tune, just goes and gets another and shuts the game off again for three more months. That's probably pretty accurate. I do my I do my my quarterly Raichu hunt. I just never connect to the internet again. And I just constantly have a Lolan Raichu outbreaks. Alright, everybody, welcome to Pokemon Coliseum. We uh I feel like hold on. Okay. Why is the music so quiet? It's because it's in the menu. Here's our team. I genuinely need to go heal up before we even continue with anything. I made it all the way down these stairs, but I have to go all the way back up. Uh, we've got Yelt, the Ampharos. Uh, he's all right. He's a little low level though. We got Hitmontop, who does need to be... Hmm. Probably won't be that long of a trip. He's definitely ready to be purified. But this is Hitmontop, the Hitmontop. This is Hente, the Ente. He's my freaking goat, dude. That is my goat. We got Fwomp, the Mischievous. Mischievous. We got Espeon, the Espeon. And then Suicune, the Suicune, uh, he's new. And that's it, that was my team. Hi Hasty, guess what? I could guess one million plus things and still be incorrect, so it's so much better if you just tell me. I can't guess, I'm physically incapable of it. It's my birthday. Okay, I could probably have guessed that, I'll be honest. <laughs> Happy birthday, Jacob. <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> The Suicune fight ruined my life as a kid? Dude, I got so lucky with that Suicune. Except, like, I know I tweeted first try. Do you guys want to know a little secret? It was not my first try. People who are here do know that, though. <laughs> but it still felt pretty cool to get that in a Pokeball without, uh, without really prepping for it. It had, like, half HP. Hasty, guess what? You love me? Is that it? Hasty, it would mean a lot to me if you can name your Raikou Trella after my dog who passed. It would mean the world. Moaning Raccoon 6905. I do not know who you are at all. I will probably be naming it Raichu. Or something really ridiculous. I will unfortunately not be naming it after your dog. But you are so more than welcome to go and catch one yourself and name it after your dog. I am so sorry. Moaning Raccoon 6905, I do not know you any more than just your username. How do I know you even actually had a dog? You know what I mean? Yeah, I'll probably be naming it like Pichu. It's a pretty good name actually. I can definitely sneak by the elevator operator. There's no way she'll battle me. Oh, it was chicken butt. Oh, I fucked up. Wrong, <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Pichu spelled... Wait, this guy fights you again too? Dog. You're kidding me. Get a life. Hello, Ragov. My goat, point five. Roller boy. Aren't we all? I'm feeling especially thankful that we've got two flying types and my Ampharos is still alive. Oh yeah, you know we're calling in our CM, dude. I'm 
I'm calling so hard right now. Wait, that wasn't the Thunderbolt hit? Oh, I didn't even notice. And Sun Thunderbolt definitely one hits here. Dude, this Ampro sucks. I'm sorry. Ampro's can't even one shot a knocked out. It's okay, we're here. You're here now, that's what matters. Guys, if I put my shoulders down too hard, does it really look like I'm not wearing a shirt? Because that's kind of what I'm going for. The morgue pie aesthetic. <laughs> Wait, I kind of like it. It'll make people click. <laughs> I'm making the best pick for you right now. Ah, I'm so excited. I think the best part about Smiling Friends is the fact that the uh, the artwork is, uh, you know, not extremely detailed, so <laughs> it's pretty easy to do, like, fan art of it and stuff. Give yourself ginormous pecs. I know, I should have, like, contoured right here or something. I can't do it, dude. My, my, my breasts are so small. It just doesn't work. It's not, it's not for me. That trend was not made for me. Sigh. <laughs> Caleb. Ah, uh, deep sigh. My, <laughs> my breasts. Yeah, sorry for saying that. Sorry for calling them breasts. I'll never do that again. Are you up against Asa? I love Asa. Asa comes here every so often. West the Raikou? Alright, someone write that down. We'll get back to that. Someday when I meet when I meet the legendary Raikou. I mean, we already found Entei and Suicune. Surely the next boss doesn't have Raikou, right? Like that would just not make any sense. You bow bow bow. Hello, Whimsy. AKA Cam, my bestie in the whole wide world. How are you, cutie? Uh, hit on top. I think it's 100% worth it to purify this guy because he's probably, I'm going to, can we take guesses right now? How much XP do we think hit on top is going to get back? I have fought so many Pokemon with this guy. I'm genuinely going to guess somewhere around 20k. 25, 15, like two. Okay, good guess, good guess. Ten <laughs> dog. Bless. <laughs> Where are my priorities? 30k, 10k, 74? Okay, I'm picking it up. All right, ready? Wait, that wasn't at all what I thought. <laughs> Um, it was under 9k. I thought it was gonna be a lot more. <laughs> uh, no, you did. You got it, Magoberry. You got it. You got it. 8859. <laughs> Wait, Kryko, how did you know? Wait, you guessed so good. You're the best guesser. Hitmontop, I'm going to name you. Emble. After my aunt. Just kidding, I just made the name up. Evan. Yeah, I'm kind of going with the whole like naming mechanic of making names that make absolutely no sense at all because not a single character that I've met in this game has a name that is a real human being's name. Like Wes? Or this guy? Like, what? What symbol even is that? That's not even a name. And after my dead dog. 
this <laughs> isn't coming. Come on, I'm kidding! I know! I know Wes is in here. <laughs> There's other names in this game that make less sense. Wes happens to be the one. I know a guy named Wes too, okay? He's a father. Not that that's relevant. I'm naming my firstborn child chat box emoji. Not if I get there first. I'm pregnant right now. Just kidding. That would be crazy. A father? Yeah. So, he gets more action than any of us, you know? <laughs> um, where am I going? Oh, yeah. Was R? Oh, yeah, yeah, it is R just. Midstream zero fanfare pregnancy reveal. Everyone's just pissed off that I announced that I'm pregnant. <laughs> Everyone's like, no, you're not. What if I was? No, I'm not. I'm sorry. Tornadus has some explaining to do. Stop. Stop calling out my baby daddy. <laughs> no. Chat, there's a crucial requirement to get pregnant. And I failed to meet that requirement. It was Tornadus. I knew it was one of them. Oh, yeah. I mean, I've been pregnant with Tornadus' baby for a long time. Fuck, I went out the wrong exit. Tynamo calm day. Hey, you're right. I was swimming in little sperm boys yesterday. I've gotta be. Frigante, you know? This is awful. Can we talk about anything else? I... <laughs> oh my god. I'm not afraid of intimacy, let me be clear. I'm not in your gang. I just don't engage in it willingly. <laughs> remember the congrats and the genuine wait, are you pregnant? Yes, oh my god, no! Do you guys remember? I posted the picture of me. <laughs> I posted the picture of me and Tornadus with the pregnancy announcement. And then like, I, I tweeted something about taking an edible at the family party like a day or two later and I got a DM from someone being like, look, I'm not sure if you were just kidding about the pregnancy or not, but I don't know if you knew this, but you probably shouldn't be taking edibles while you're, <laughs> while you're pregnant. <laughs> that... <laughs> that message cracked me up so fucking bad, but also I didn't respond to it because I don't want them to ever know. I don't want anyone to ever know the truth. I want I want it to always be a lingering question. Am I due or not? <laughs> uh, that's so funny. Hot take, Thunderous is hotter. <sighs> I'm hovering over the ban. I'm so sorry. It's Tornadus over all. I'd put Landorus over Thunderous. I said it. I said it. Lando T? Yes! Yes, Kathy! You get it. You get it. Lando T? I'm sitting on it. He's back. I mean, because he's like hunched over, you know? I'm just kidding. Yeah, Lando T is hot. Honestly. Intimidate? Shakes me to my core, you know? I'd let him rock slide me? He'd quake my earth. You know what I mean? <laughs> Anyways. <clears throat> Anyways, we're playing a video game. Can you guys stop distracting me with all these hot Pokemon? I read Warrior Cats. We're gonna pretend I wouldn't get it. Anything you know better than any of us. Wait, so Viper and Sneasel? Ew, wait, that Sneasel model looked really bad. What? Hold on, I need to see that again. Is it the Sneasel? Ugh. Ew! Ew! Like, I know it's supposed to be claws, but they look like little fingies! Oh, uh, I'm not a fan, unfortunately. I do not like that. I'm gonna triple kick the Viper. Maybe that'll do something. This is the best game! I'm not here to argue. Wait. What? Wait. Did it triple kick? What just happened? 
Did that just really do nothing? Did it even hit it three times? That was weird. Okay. Okay. I think Yelp is a little too fast. I don't know. It's weird. Uh, what, what is Sneasel looking at? Yeah, Sneasel. Ew! I didn't like that either. Survivor model goes crazy. It's freaky. <gasps> okay, okay. Oh my gorb. Yelt is going to swap into Entei. And then, I don't know, we try that again. Like what? I need to see more. Maybe we get a couple crits out there. It just didn't look like he got hit three times. Like I didn't see three like We're so back, right? We're back. We're so back. All right, sorry about that. It happens, sorry. Nope. Okay. Hello? You thought this was too zoomed in? Yes! I was like, that's so much of my face. Was too much. You know? I was so nervous. I've never seen that much of my face get shown before. In such detail, too! I hate it. But I like it. Okay, anyway, sorry about that. We're so back. I'm honestly gonna try to use a Pokeball. Sneasel was trying to defend his honor. Fuck your honor, Sneasel. I'm gonna snag you. Rider Nellis. Like, what is Nellis? Who is that? Never heard of her. Yuck. Goodbye, Surviper. Hardly knew ya. <gasps> Corsola! I got a shiny one of those the other weekend! Game so broken, my whole damn stream broke. What if I use a rapid spin? He might die. I mean, I don't really need Sneasel, I'm gonna be honest. Oh yeah, wow, that did actually nothing. Okay, great. You can't confuse him, he has no brain. Watch this. Now watch this. Triple kick, we're gonna end this guy's whole career. Nellis, ain't that the guy who's saying hot in here? This is a pretty good stream title, I think. Thanks. I appreciate that. Hit one time? That's not triple. I'm so lost on where this three consecutive kicking got. 
got fucked up. Triple kick. No, my hentai died. Generations three and four. Each strike has a 90% base accuracy. There's a 72.9% chance that it will hit three times. An 8.1% chance that it will hit twice, and a 9% chance that it will hit once. And 10% chance it'll miss outright. Look, I don't want to be dramatic, but that's kind of bullshit. <laughs> what the heck? Rolls an accuracy check every kick. This is this is BS. Yeah, that's how it works for just gens three and four in general. It's not that's not specific to Coliseum. This is on Le Bulbapedia. Doo doo. Do, do, do. I think triple axle is the same way. Yeah, I guess so. It's just one of those game or one of those moves where it's like, I didn't realize. I didn't realize they could really miss. <laughs> I thought they were like 100% accurate. <laughs> They're out. Like a double slap. Double slap is 100% accurate, right? Or am I crazy? Right? Le Bulba Petey. Petey. Bulba Petey? Ain't that the guy from Family Guy? You guys ever watch Family Guy on Ironically? I mean that seriously. Actually, I saw this tweet earlier. I will read it for you. I will read it for you. La 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 la. There's a tweet that someone posted. <laughs> someone, someone posted a tweet with a text message that says, from a girl named Sarah. Me, I'm Sarah, by the way. Hey, I don't think I want to go on another date. And your Peter Griffin impression was really weird. He would never say those sexual things. Quagmire usually says that stuff. It wasn't actual, and then dot, 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 like trailing off, like she really kept going. I was like, I swear to God, I, that's, I would send that text. I would. No two ways about it. That sounds like something I would definitely say to, to, to a potential bachelor. If you're, if you're, <laughs> if you're imitating Peter Griffin and you're saying something out of character, I will call you out on that shit, okay? Peter Griffin would never fucking say that. <laughs> Sky, thank you! Yeah, we're kind of high quality now, what can I say? We've made it. <gasps> Venus, before that horrible boy can meddle anymore, I'll link up with Ayn at the Shadow Pokemon Lab. <gasps> Eek, eek! Why did you have to chase me here? It's so unfair. This isn't good. I can't lead them to the lab. <gasps> so she goes to the lab? Is that what's happening here? What's over here? Nothing? See the tweet where it's like, if you don't know a guy's sexuality, ask him to do a family guy impression. <laughs> no, but that's pretty funny. Ooh, black glasses? Yeah, I mean, if I had my Umbreon on the team, that would make sense, but I don't. But I, alas, do not. You like Ayn? He's basically just Charon, but crazier. Hi, Adriana. Yeah, we're kind of popping off, right? Look at it. Move, Cindy! Why couldn't they make the pathway... <laughs> <laughs> the width to hold two people so I can walk around her when I want to turn around. <gasps> so silly goofy. Keys missing? Oh, okay. Sorry. Sorry, sorry.
What's happening here? Jail key? Okay. Oh. Oh! Oh, you are so easy to dupe. I mean, you got me. You really did. See? The key for the shadow liner is right here. You didn't think I would really let you take our train? Bleh. Bye-bye, and this time I mean it. Don't you dare forget about me. I could never, Venus. Okay. Well, she, I mean, she really got my ass. I'm not gonna lie. She had me fooled. She had me mega fooled. So what, I just leave now? Yeah, Mary would do a phenomenal Venus cosplay. Genuinely. Hopefully I'm going the right way because if I have to walk down those stairs again, I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna commit a cry. I'm going to commit one tear shedding. Can I? Yeah, unlock the door. Here we go. Let's get out of here. Hi, you can, uh... Thank you. Flushed. Flush D. Hi, you. Thanks for seven months. Appreciate you, dog. How's your night going? Climbing stairs in-game in IRL. Dude. I can't stand parts of games where it's, like, just tons of staircases. Asa, we were just talking about you. Congrats on winning the MSS! <laughs> we were just talking about you. That's so funny. Because Acorn was in that too. Uh, the Pokemon eyeshadow makeup you got before just came in the mail? Yes! Let's go! Let's go. <laughs> I'm excited for you. I hope you like it. Uh, I'm gonna guess Pyrite Town? I don't know. But good to see you. I hope you're having a great night, Asa. Hello, Spooky. Hello, hello. Um, let's go talk to my man. Duking. Hmm. What were those two women up to on the ground floor of that beat-up building? Okay. Asa's been on my stream for a really long time. Asa's been around. Okay, what defwick? Where defwick am I going? I'm as okay. I'm assuming just un the under again somewhere. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Hi, Era. Oh my god, those bangs that face. Stop! Stop! You're gassing me up. I fucking love you. Hi, Angel. How are you, cutie? I hope you're doing well. I know. Chat's kind of popping off. Kind of a party in here right now. Oh wait, Silwa! Oh my god. Wait, I didn't find the key to this place, did I? <laughs> um, oh, you're so right. Okay, well. I mean, surely. Surely I probably have to go back down the stairs. It's probably... <gasps> no, I have to go do the Coliseum challenge! Right? That's gotta be it. Every day I'm sub to hasty glue. That has to be it. That's how... Okay. I forgot. I forgot that that's a thing I do. Uh, Acorn, thank you for the... Thank you for the gifted sub to Asa. That's very sweet. Thank you, thank you. I'm finally home in new PST time. You being live this early is so weird to me. Oh my gosh. I can't believe you're in PST now. That's absurd. I've never lived in PST time. It's gonna be so different for you. I'm so excited. I hope you're doing well though, cutie. I hope I hope you're finally chilling, relaxing. 
We've been all over the place the last, like, month. You've never been to PST time? I mean, it's very different. It's very different, because I have the ability to, like, stay up late no matter what time zone I'm in. Except, like, staying up late... Like, staying up until, like, 2 a.m. in Pacific Standard Time is doable because I like staying up late, but also not doable because you realize that 2 a.m. Pacific Time is technically 5 a.m. to what your body is used to. And so it's kind of a lose-lose no matter what. Wait! Okay, so I can't do the Coliseum Challenge. Guys, I'm about to McFreaking. I'm about to McFreaking. Am I really going down the stairs again? I guess so. I suppose. What was over down right there again? I don't remember what you're supposed to do here. I will figure it out. I believe. TwitchCon in San Diego when I would be out late with people I was dragging. Yeah, San Diego was exhausting. I'm so excited for TwitchCon this year. It's gonna be a blast. I think it's gonna be a blast and a half. When we were in Vegas, I couldn't believe we stayed up until 5 a.m. Those casinos hit different. Yeah, those casinos, like, they they pump you with the enough oxygen to stay up 24-7. Oh! Oh my god. You absolute fool. You absolute buffoon. The number of times that I've missed a little... Dude, I can't do this. Okay. The number of times that I've missed a silly, goofy, sparkly thing. Um... Surely it's this way. How come... She's like, the subway key is right here. You're never gonna get it. And then they drop it on the floor on the way out? I'm sorry. Take better care of your items. Aw, look at Wes as a subway operator. He's doing great. Resident Evil 2. Legit. Oh! Not gonna lie, I probably should have revived. I didn't need to! I did it, I think. Or they did it for me by accident. Yeah, Venus is incredibly beautiful, but also incredibly incompetent. You're so right. Yo, how's it going? Just getting off shift? Huh? Wasn't Lady Venus supposed to be coming today? Huh? Hmm. I've seen your faces somewhere. That's it. The blacklist. <laughs> You're Hasty and Cindy. How did you get down here? Ah, this won't do. We can't let these two get into the shadow Pokemon lab. Oh, I thought they were going to battle me. Cowards. I am making a mistake by... Okay. Oh, come on. Come on, they really couldn't make it one pixel wider. Okay, great. What? They just... Wait. Did they just blow up the whole lab? What's in this box? You disc? No, you disc. What the frick? Uh, everyone good in here? Oh. Ah, okay. Yeah, that's normal. Yeah, let's just blow up half of our building. That's, yeah, that's normal. You'll never be able to chase us now. Uh, don't you think that was overdoing things a little? Yes. Uh, well, it's too late now. Come on, let's skedaddle. <laughs> Bro just blew up a building and has the audacity to use the term skedaddle afterwards. Me after just blowing up a building? Let's skedaddle. Like, are they good? There's a sparkly thing here. A main gate key. Okay, perfect. 
Oh, I'm thinking that's the jail key, actually. Oh, okay. Maybe it's not. I thought I thought that little part there was like enough. To cross. Fave mode of transportation, skedaddling. If they made a public transportation system like, you know, like the metro or whatever called the skedaddler, I'd be first in line. I'm commuting to work through that thing. Absolutely. The skedaddler. <laughs> Scooby Doo ass fucking mode of transportation. Yeah, Pogo. I've been I've been doing a really good job of getting back into into Pogo lately too. I feel like GoFest always gets me back into a little burst of of going. But um, but I am I am occasionally I've been getting really good at staying up to date with like with gifts between friends that I know will open and give me another gift back in exchange quickly. Um, my gift game has been getting better. Eris, Era, are we friends on Go? On Pokemon Go? We should be, if not. I feel like we are. I can't remember. I don't think you're my friend. Oh my god, yeah, no, I would, yeah, please add me. Um, I'm trying to think. Yeah, I guess we aren't friends. But I can send you a screenshot of my- or a, I can copy and send you my friend code. My FWEM code. Okay, the main gate key. I'm really- I'm taking a- I'm taking a risk here. I'm taking a ginormous risk here. Actually, before I do that, I'm gonna use this U disk and I'm assuming it's to get that item over there. So many people don't open my gifts? Yeah. Goldfest was awesome. I made a lot of friends who are good with the gifting. But I I have the I have the same deal. I mean like I have oh wait, what? Okay, we go up. Wait, what the fuck? Okay, this is I'm not gonna lie, this is not what I expected. Okay, cool. What? Another time flute! Oh that's dope! I thought there was only one of those ever. Okay, sick. They just got time flutes all over the place. That's awesome. Oh, I'm so in. I'm Suicuning this bitch. Okay, yeah, I can be better. Ah! Harumi. <laughs> Harumi sending me a gift. I think it's stupid you can send more gifts than you can open in a day. Wait, you can send more gifts than you can open a day? Are you sure? You can only send and receive one gift from one person. So I'm not sure what you mean by that. At least that's what I thought. Harumi, I'm gonna open your thing. I'm opening your gift. Wow, I got a max revive. I will send you this in return. I always feel so shameful sending gifts that are either Verizon or Starbucks Pokestop gifts. Like, it feels embarrassing, you know? It's like, like I got a gift the other day, it was like, Veri it was like, no, it was Starbucks from New York, New York. It's like, okay, which one? There's only 500 billion thousand of them, you know? Give me some wacky public art Pokestop, you know? Hello, Uchiha Adam. Hello. Oh. You can only open- wait, really? You can't- I guess I've never tried opening more than 30. I guess I don't have that many friends. Happy 15 months of being <gasps> parasocial slave. Yay! Dream. Oh wait, it's already open. What the hell? Okay, well, 
Silva. All right. Dream, thank you for 50 months. Hello. How are you? Dig the new camera? Thanks. I couldn't have done it without all of your parasocial donations. <laughs> Just kidding. Just kidding. I bought it with my own money. For cheap. But I appreciate you. Thanks for thanks for the 50 months. <clears throat> That's our camera. I hit weekends. You drunk? What's going on? You good? Hour eight? Okay. Wow. Are you good, man? What's going on? <laughs> Saying one of the weirdest postcards I currently have. Godspeed. Alright. I will open it shortly main gate key okay i'm gonna guess that that's to the pokemon lab then since silva already got escaped i don't know <clears throat> now i get to color <gasps> mela i'm pumped I put my pogo code in general pokemon swag okay cool 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 <clears throat> i probably have a request or a research task out there somewhere to add a new friend so this will be perfect Hello, Duking. Wait, what? <clears throat> Where is Silva? I thought Silva was gonna come back to Duking. Do I keep leaving this place before I'm supposed to? What the fuck? It's the Reese's Cup edible? I want one. No invite? Mail me one. Shoot, I am not sure where Silva went. I guess I'll go back down. Oops. Exchange three gifts at the end of Roots. I don't even know what you're talking about. I've never done a root. I'm not gonna lie. I have never done one. Hi, barbecue. How are you, barbecue tea? Hi, Wook. Hello, baby. How are you? Yeah, the party play is really cool. Just a good way to. Okay, what did this guy say? Guy they had caged, let him escape. He wanted me to tell you thanks. Okay, like, and then what? What do you mean? Oh my god, I know where I'm supposed to go. I know where I'm supposed to go. Okay, I know. <clears throat> when you do a route, there's an NPC that pops up and will exchange a